Nawab Iftikhar Hussain Khan of Mamdo, the 31st of December 1906 to the 16th of October 1969, was a Pakistani politician from the Punjab and a key supporter of the Pakistan movement in British India. Topic: Early life. Mamdo was born at Lahore in 1906. He was the son Shanawas Khan and a member of the ruling family of Mamdo. He was educated at Government College, Lahore, and thereafter joined the police service of Hyderabad State in the Deccan. On the death of his father in 1942 he succeeded him as the Nawab of Mamdo and on inheriting his lands become the largest landowner in the Punjab. He also succeeded his father in politics as president of the Punjab Muslim League between 1942 and 1944. He actively worked to encourage the wealthy landowners of the Punjab to drop their support for the Unionist Party and support the Pakistan movement. In 1946, he was elected to the Punjab Legislative Assembly. Later that year, he was the only Muslim League leader in the Punjab who supported Muhammad Ali Jinnah's call for the voluntary exchange of the populations within the Punjab. During the partition of India in 1947 he migrated to Pakistan, abandoning his vast landholdings in eastern Punjab which became part of the Republic of India. <laughs> <laughs> Chief Minister of West Punjab On 15 August 1947, he was appointed as the first Chief Minister of West Punjab in Pakistan. Having foregone his constituency in Firozepur district and extensive estates in East Punjab, Mamdo sought to rebuild his powerbase in Pakistan. Without official sanction, he created the Allotment Revising Committee to cultivate new followers amongst refugees, and allegedly siphoned off properties and cars to his followers and former tenants. He became the largest claimant for agricultural land amongst the refugees. He opposed his Minister for Refugee Rehabilitation Mian Iftikharuddin, whose reformist proposals advocated permanently settling refugees on evacuee property and excess land belonging to bigger landlords. His stance, together with his refusal to cooperate with the centrally appointed Pakistan and West Punjab Refugee and Rehabilitation Council led to the resignation of Mian Iftikharuddin, and provided a free hand to Mamdo to allocate evacuee properties as he wished. Factionalism plagued Mamdo's ministry. Aside from conflict with Mian Iftikharuddin and Ghazanfar Ali Khan, head of the Refugee and Rehabilitation Council, he clashed with Mumtaz Daltana and Sir Francis Muddy. He labelled Muddy, the first governor of West Punjab, a foreigner, pro-unionist, and pro-Indian. And in turn, Muddy criticized him, alleging that he remained in power to get his hands on more property. Mamdo's ministry endured widespread accusations of corruption and was labelled unbelievably corrupt by one British official. It was alleged he used public funds to personally acquire about 2,000 acres of prime agricultural land at nominal rates in Montgomery District, that he awarded to his brother several hundred acres of land in the same district that belonged to Sir Kizar Hayat Tawana and that he secretly deposited over 100,000 rupees from the Kashmir Fund to his brother. Rival politicians alleged that he diluted their power bases by relocating their supporters randomly across the province. A spokesman for the Rajput refugee community criticized Mamdo for not settling refugees together in accordance with the districts they came from, and noted that one village had refugees from between 13 14 different East Punjab districts which resulted in clashes on a daily basis. Mamdo resigned as chief minister in 1949 and an official enquiry was launched against him in relation to maladministration. As no one was able to form a new ministry, the governor of West Punjab assumed direct control of the province. In 1950, he left the Muslim League to form a new party, the Jinnah Muslim League, which contested the 1951 elections against the Muslim League led by his arch rival Mumtaz Daltana. One consequence of the claims against Mamdo appeared following the result of the election, as representatives of refugees constituted just 5% of the Punjab Assembly, despite refugees constituting about one-third of the total Punjabi population. <laughs> Later life He rejoined the Muslim League in 1953 and was appointed Governor of Sindh by Sir Ghulam Muhammad in 1954 He resigned his post in 1955 following the departure of Sir Ghulam from the political scene, and thereafter remained in the political wilderness. 
Mamdo died in Lahore on the 16th of October 1969.